Welcome and let's solve this beautiful equation together. Just so easy. So let's do it to begin with our solution. So this is what we have. 2 to the power of A multiplied by 2 to the power of A is equal to 100. Now what do you do? Just remember, for every A to the power of M multiplied by A to the power of N, it is A to the power of M plus N. So you are free to add the powers when it's multiplying. So we have 2 to the power of A at A is equal to 100. Now what do you do next? This gives us 2 to the power, add this, it gives us 2A is equal to 100. Now at this point, you just need to remember, for every A to the power of M raised to power N, is A to the power of M multiplied by N, which is A to the power of N raised to power of M. So here, this can be written as 2 to the power of 2 raised to power of A is equal to 100. Keep solving. If you are a returning viewer, thank you very much for choosing to learn Cheerios. And if you are still new, hit that subscription button. We have a lot to give to you every day. And if you find this interesting, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Let's know what you feel about it. So we keep solving this to have. So this gives us 2 to the power of 2 is no is 2 multiplied 2 times. So that gives us 4 to the power of A is equal to 100. At this point, you can take the log of both sides. So you have log of 4 to the power of A is equal to log of 100. Now remember also, for every log of A to the power of X, it is X log A. The power multiplies the log. So this power multiplies. So we're going to have a log 4 is equal to log of 100. So we keep solving this. And that gives us to get a divide both sides by log of 4. Do same here. So this takes off this. This gives us A is equal to log of 100 divided by log of 4. Now what do you do next? This is the same as a is equal to, now remember that 100 is the same as 10 multiplied 2 times, which is 10 squared. So for this, we are going to have log of 10 squared, and this is divided by, we still rewrite this to give us log of 2 squared. So what do you do? The power multiplies the log, as we have said earlier. So keep solving. A is equal to, so this multiplies, we have 2 log 10 divided, this will multiply, we have 2 log 2. Now what do you do? This is A is equal to, this will take off, we have log of 10 divided by log of 2. Know also that 10 is the same as 5 multiplied by 2. So we're going to apply it to half. This gives us A is equal to log of 5 multiplied by 2 is divided by log of 2. Keep solving. Remember, for every log of A multiplied by B, it's always log of A plus log of B. Multiplication turns to addition. So if you apply it here, we have A is equal to log of 5 plus log of 2 divided by log of 2. And this is the same as A is, use this to divide each. So you have log of 5 divided by log of 2 plus log of 2 divided by log of 2. So this is the same as A is equal to log of 5 divided by log of 2 plus this will divide itself to give us 1. Now, Remember that for every log of A divided by log of B, it's always log of A base B. We are going to apply this change of base rule here to have. So this gives us A is equal to log of 5. From here we have base 2 plus 1. And this is the simplified value of A. Now we're going to plug this A value on the left side to see if it gives us back 100. And I hope you've already given us a thumbs up. 
Let's also know what to feel about this class. Let's verify this together to have. To verify, so we have 2, this is our A, log of 5 base 2 plus 1 multiplied by 2 to the power of log of 5 base 2 plus 1. Will this be equal to, will this give us 100? Let's bring it down. Will this give us 100? Let's do that together. So what do you do here? Just remember, for every, for every a to the power of m plus n, it is a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. So you can split the addition with turn to multiplication. So this gives us 2 to the power of log of 5 base 2. This will turn to multiplication 2 to the power of 1. Then we bring down the multiplication. Do same here. 2 to the power of log of 5 base 2 is multiplied by 2 to the power of 1. Let's just see if it gives us back 100. So keep solving. Now, remember that for every a to the power of log of b base a, these two bases are the same. It gives you this number b. So if you apply this rule on this, it gives us, did you observe that these two are the same? Did you? So this means this gives us 5 multiplied by 2 to the power of 1 is 2. Do same here. This will give us 5 multiplied 2 to the power of 1 is 2. Now what do you do? 2 times, 5 times 2 will give us 10. And 10 times 5 is 50. 50 times 2 will give us 100. And that is what we have at the right side. So it means that this value of A we got is absolutely correct. And I hope you really learned something. Don't forget to like this video, share. Let's know also what you feel or your own method about this class. I'll be expecting it in the comments. See you in my next class. Bye.